Well, freeze warnings were issued for North Florida, including Gainesville and Alachua County for December the 5th. The cold front had already passed through, bringing low humidity at nearly all levels in the troposphere. The conditions for persistent contrails were essentially zero. The absence of contrails at other latitudes further supports deployment of artificial cirrus clouds. The climate managers decided to keep things above record low temperatures with a selective dump of climate warming aerosols to trap the warmth of long wave radiation beneath the artificial cirrus level cloud layer. So instead of freezing conditions at 32 degrees as was the forecast, we were spared with temps of 34 to 36 degrees and higher. I started taking photos at about 8 o'clock a.m. on the 5th. Notice the translucent layering of artificial cirrus clouds. Orientation of the strands and tentacles are extremely variable, suggesting the use of pressurized nozzles. And notice the sudden on and off persistent aerosol contrails. The camera swings around from the backyard over the roof line to show us the chemical solar halo. Now this segment is at noon on the same day, December the 5th, at the 43rd Street Deli located at I-75 and Williston Road. Notice the sudden start and stop of the trails under exceedingly dry atmospheric conditions behind the cold front. We'll just let this play for a couple of minutes so you can see what happens in the sky, then we'll uh, finish up with a comment before we end the video. Now this last segment is the same day, December the 5th at about 3 p.m. The spraying continues. Notice that even where the sky appears to be blue, you can detect a chemical haze. The untrained observer can look up and see what he thinks is a blue sky, while ignoring the almost perpetual chemical haze that infects the atmosphere. <laughs> 